Hey guys, this is Deathfire D coming at you with another tech related video. This one is on connecting your PS4 Bluetooth game controller to a Steam Link. Now the process is pretty easy. If you don't have a Steam Link game controller, don't worry about it because the PlayStation and I believe the Xbox game controllers connect perfectly fine with the Steam Link. I could be wrong about Xbox. I don't have one, so I can't test it. But um, I'm going to walk you through the, the easy steps to do this. Shouldn't take more than a few minutes. So first thing you're going to want to do is obviously go into settings and uh, scroll over to Bluetooth and click on that. So on here you can see that my PlayStation 4 remote is showing up because I'm connected to the Steam Link using a USB cable. You're going to need to do this. If you don't have a game controller, then there's no way that you can play or set up the Steam Link. You can't just turn Bluetooth on and have the Steam Link recognize it. You have to, do, you have to initiate the pairing process, which is, um, which is exactly what I'm about to show you guys. So once you're in the Bluetooth setup, what you're going to want to do is press the X button to initiate pairing mode. And once you do that, you're going to want to remove the USB cable from your controller. And you're going to want to press the PlayStation emblem on the bottom and the share button at the same time for a few seconds. Then let go. Once you do that, you'll see the light by the, the, the word Sony in the back start blinking. That means it's in pairing mode. Now because we pressed X before we unplugged the cable, the Steam Link will continuously look for Bluetooth devices in the room. As soon as we turn the remote on pairing mode, the Steam Link should notice it and connect. Now you will notice as soon as I unplug the controller, the screen will change and you'll see a message saying please connect a remote or a gamepad or something, don't worry about it because as soon as the Steam Link connects via Bluetooth to your game controller, the message will go away and you'll come back to this screen. So without further ado, I'll show you guys how to do it. So press the X button. All right, we unplug and we press the PlayStation and share button. Now it starts blinking and now we're connected. So now, if you press the circle button to go back, as you can see, we have full control of the Steam Link via the PlayStation 4 controller using Bluetooth. It's as easy as that, guys. You can do this with, um, I think, pretty much any Bluetooth controller. Could be wrong, though. I haven't really done much research on that. But uh, hopefully this helped you guys out. Um, stay tuned for some more videos coming out. I have uh, a few tech-related videos that I'm in the process of making and a few more Jeep or automotive-related videos coming out. And uh, if you guys like what you see, please give me a good old thumbs up. If you have any questions or concerns or even suggestions, please leave a comment below. I re read the comments religiously. Um, and yeah, please subscribe. 